everyone! Welcome to Season 2, Episode 5 of Mommy and Me Tutorials. We have another unequal sharing question for you today. Would you like to read? Sure. King Roland shared $620 among his three children, Sophia, Amber, and James. If Sophia received $10 more than Amber, who received $80 more than James, calculate how much money each child received. So what you're saying is that Amber received more money than James? Yes. And Sophia received more money than Amber? Yes. Yes. So why would King Roland give Sophia the greatest amount of money though? Because Sophia was his favorite. Why do you say that? Since he gave her the amulet. <laughs> <laughs> so that makes his favorite. Yes. Yes. The parents have favorites. Are they allowed to have favorites? Yes. Like, I'm your favorite. You're my only child. <laughs> what that, does that, it count? That proves my point. Though. Okay. <laughs> right. So James received how much money? An unknown amount. Unknown amount. We Let's don't know how much. A box. A box. A blue box. <laughs> a blue box. <laughs> and how much money did Amber receive? Amber received $80 more than James. So if James received box, Amber received $80. $80 more than the box. So box, box plus, plus an additional $80. $80. Okay. And how much money did Sophia receive? Sophia received $10 more than Amber. So if Amber received box plus $80, hence, and Sophia received how much? $10, $10 more, more than, than that. Amber. So then so, so Sophia received... Amber's amount plus an additional, additional $10. $10. $10. And poor James just received a known amount. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, and we're saying that Amber received $80 more than James. Yes. So that means she received more money than, than him. him. And then Sophia received $10 more, more than, than Amber. Amber. So we're saying that James received the least amount of money and Sophia received the most amount of money. Okay, so what's our first step? We need to calculate how much money James, Amber, and Sophia each receive. receive. So what's our first step? Hmm. Our first step would be to identify who received the least amount of money. That's poor James. Poor, poor James. Wait, wait, I thought Amber and James were twins though. Yeah. So why would Amber receive more money than James? Because James <laughs> did something naughty. <laughs> All right. So we're assigning a box, box to James. James. Okay, what's ours? And that's our blue box. Yes, same box. Same box. <laughs> How much money did Amber receive? So we know that Amber received $80 more than James. Mm -hmm. Yes. So now we are signing box plus $80 to Amber. Okay. So this box is the same box that we have here, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Good. So what's our third step? Step three is to identify how much money Sophia received. Mm -hmm. Now she received how much money again? She received $10 more than Amber. Ooh. So Amber received this amount and Sophia received that amount plus, plus an additional, additional $10. $10. And this is how we'll write it. So in summary, James received box, Amber is James amount plus $80. Good. And Sophia received Amber's amount plus, plus an, an additional, additional $10. Okay. What's our next step? Our next step, step four. Mm -hmm. Build a relationship. Okay, so let's do that. So James received box. Right. Amber received his box plus $80. Right. And Sophia received Amber's amount right. plus an, an additional, additional $10. Okay. So what do we mean by building the relationship? Hmm. Mm hmm Building the relationship means we need to put together their sums of money. Okay, so how do we put it together? So James', James amount, which is a box, a box plus Amber's, Amber's amount. amount. So that's Amber's amount. Yes. Yes. Plus Sophia's, Sophia's amount. amount. And we need to add this up together. Yes. Yes. So now we have one box 
plus one box plus another box. Should we add the boxes together? Yes, Liz? we should. Okay, so if we have three separate empty boxes all together, how many boxes is that? Three. So that's three boxes. So that's how we write it down. Yes. Okay, and if we have $80 hmm. plus $80, $80 plus $10, how much does that add up to? $170. Are you sure? Yes. Yes. <laughs> and all of that should add up to $620. Why $620? Where did we get that amount from? That is the amount that King Roland shared among his three children. Right. So that's, that's the total, total amount, $620. Okay. So now we have three boxes plus $170 equals to $620. What do we do next? Our next step, step four. Step five. <laughs> Step five. Sorry. Remove or minus the extra from the total. What's the extra? What's the total? The total is how much money King Roland shared all right. together. Right. So that's six hundred and twenty dollars. Okay, makes sense. And we want to remove your know, minus one hundred and seventy dollars to find our three, three shares. shares. How much three shares is equal to? Okay. So that now becomes. Three boxes would be the total minus extra, which is 620 yeah. minus 170, mm -hmm. and three boxes equal to $450. Okay, so what's our next step? Step six, divide the remainder by the number of equal shares. So we know we have three equal shares. Right. So three box, three, three boxes <laughs> are equal to $450. Right. So, so now, hence, one box would be $450 divided by three. Mm -hmm. And that will give us $150. So $450 divided by three equals to $150, $150. which is one box. Okay. So, oh, that was our remainder. And that was our number of equal yes. shares there. Yes. Okay. So we took the remainder and we divided by the total number, total number of total equal, number equal shares. shares. Okay. What's our next step? Step seven. Calculate James, Amber's, and Sophia's share. Hmm. So now we know box equals to $150. And since James has box, box. he received $150. From King Roland. Yes. Okay. And hence, Amber, we know box equals to $150. So what's Amber's share? Amber received $80 more than James. Right. So if James received one hundred and fifty dollars. Mm -hmm. You add her extra eighty dollars to the one hundred and fifty, and Amber received two hundred and thirty dollars. Right. Okay. Excellent. So we could also say well, box was equal to one hundred and fifty dollars, and we add the eighty dollars, and that's what gave us two hundred and thirty dollars. And then finally, we need to determine what was Sophia's share. Hmm. So how do we get Sophia's share now? We know Sophia received $10 more than Amber. Ew. So Amber received $230. $30. So $230 was Amber's $150 plus $80. Plus $80. And then you're saying that we Sophia have received... 10 additional dollars. 10 additional dollars more, more than, than Amber. Amber. All right. So Amber received $230 plus $10, $10. equals to $240. Or we can say that box equals $150. And Sophia's share was box plus $80 plus, plus $10. So that's $150 plus $80 plus $10. Which is $240. All right. So just running this through again. The question asks us, how much money did each child, child received? received? So last time we're saying that Sophia received $10 more than Amber. And Amber received $80 more than James. James. So just making sure we're okay. So $150 plus $80 would give us $230. $230. And... Amber received $80 more than James, and Sophia received $10 more, more than, than Amber. Amber. So $230 plus $10 would give us $240. Can we confirm our answer to make sure it's correct? Is there a way to do that? Yes. So 
if we know how much money each child received, mm -hmm. and if we add up their their shares, right, that number should be the total that King Roland shared altogether. Okay, which is the one fifty that yes. James received, okay. the two hundred and thirty that Amber received, mm -hmm. and the two forty that Sophia received, and that adds up to six hundred and twenty dollars. That 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 is how much the king shared in total to all his three children. children. All right, and what did the question ask us again? Calculate how much money each child received. And our answer is James, James received $150, Amber received $230, and Sophia received $240. Great job. All right, that's it. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Bye.